Oh, yes. <laughs> um, just so that I understand, yeah. Um, it seems somewhat unfair, doesn't it? Yes. Mm -hmm. That Clallam County and the state of Washington are refusing to enforce the laws that are in these books. Yeah. <laughs> and I, I just wanted to know, um, uh, do you have to buy these? Um, uh, could you get me the sale of every, uh, laws of the state of Washington? Yeah. Oh, for the last 50 years. Could you go on their website so you could order these? Yes. Mm -hmm. See, um, I'm having a difficult time understanding yes, why it is that you think obstructing me from suing you isn't defrauding the United States of America. Um, these emission tests, yes. There's an exemption to them? Yeah. Mm hmm uh, well, why don't we go through the emission stations again and every employee, yes, that said that certificates must have a date of validation that is within 12 months of the assigned res registration renewal date, yes. Uh, these individuals that have driver's license, uh, driver's licenses, identity cards, yes. Uh, they happen to be, uh, taxpayers, ouch. Well, I know it's a sales tax, but exactly uh, motor vehicles that are 2009 uh, model year or newer, yeah, uh, are exempt from emission test requirements. Yeah, motor vehicles that are less than five years old or more than 25 years old, yes. Well, that would be 20 years worth of vehicles, right. <laughs> now, I, I did own a vehicle that went through emissions every couple of years, yes. Mm-hmm. And as I remember it, you couldn't get your tabs renewed without passing emissions. Could you get me the taxation of the emission systems of every vehicle? Yes. Because uh, you keep selling these books. Yes. Known as the laws of the state of Washington. And then you keep depriving me of the enforcement of them. Now it sounds frivolous, doesn't it? Uh, snowmobile license fees? Oops. Health benefit plans, yeah. community forest trucks. Um, is there is there some reason why you're allowing for forgery and fraud? They just don't. They don't. Civil liberties, public education program. Mm -hmm. uh, whistleblowers, education, crimes, coercion, and voluntary servitude. Page two hundred and eighty-four. Yes. Now, uh, I had documented, yes, that I hadn't emailed any of the co-workers of Heidi Budnick. Yes. But the state said I did. And they said I was in Brennan or they said the email was in Brennan. <laughs> now, I did email all the other civil rights coordinators. Yes. And it looks to me like their refusal to enforce my rights. Yes. And the rights of my sons. Right. And the rights of Marilyn. Poop. Um, that, uh, give me all the emissions locations, yes, and every vehicle that's been through emissions for the last 20 years, mm -hmm. get me the driver's licenses, yes, I'm looking for signatures, signatures, now, um, uh, looks like the fees and taxes required by law, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Now, this is chapter 80. Uh, leaseholder person changes his or her name. Vehicle registration. Yes. Uh, does everybody have to go through emissions? Or is, is it, is it, well, it, it, you pay $4 for motorcycle, Washington state fees. Uh huh. Now, it seems frivolous that you make people do this. Pooh. But it, it looks to me like you're just not enforcing all the laws in this uh, in this book. Yeah. Now, um, I'm having to uh, experience involuntary servitude. Yes. Where I'm in service to the state because you will not free me from your uh, fraud and forgery. Yeah. You won't free my sons from their actual school. Yes. You don't recognize my custody rights. Poop. And then um, there's this idea that when they're in the wrong grades, you're obligating them to continue in school. Yes. 
Um, ooh, background checks persons with access to children or vulnerable adults. <laughs> you mean all of the all these background checks? Yes. Uh-huh. Uh, mandatory uh, um, Secretary of Social and Health Service, Secretary of Health shall adopt additional requirements oh, for the licensure or relicensure of agencies, facilities, and licensed individuals to provide care and treatment of vulnerable adults. <laughs> Associated license facility. Oh, the person shall make the disclosures in writing. Yes, sign and swear to the contents under the penalty of perjury. <laughs> the person shall, in the disclosures, specify all crimes against children or other persons, <laughs> all crimes relating to financial exploitation, all crimes related to uh, drugs as defined in RCW 43.43.830. Oh. Now, for all of you that are mandatory reporters, yes, inclusive of every person that's had any interaction with my sons, under the penalty of perjury. Ooh, look at that. You had to do it in writing, you had to sign it, and you had to swear. Oh. Now, um, these crimes against my five sons right now. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, then there's Legina, yes. And I'd like to speak to Marilyn about her other five children, the biological children. <laughs> Wanted to do some genetic testing to make sure that Mike's the father. <clears throat> well, it looks to me like um, all those mandatory reporters are in violation. Yes, yes, yes. Of these RCWs. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then um, any and all individual defense was simple assault of fourth degree or the same offense was prostitution. Yeah. Third degree, same offense, rename, years of past, most conviction of application of employment. Yeah. Uh, are there any individuals that have been arrested or convicted of any crimes that happen to be around my sons for the last eight years? Well, why don't you give me the background checks of every mandatory reporter? Yes. And all of those that had sworn under the penalty of perjury? Yes. That they're... Well, I, I told you that I wanted them. Um, uh, um, you know, you're going to get sued as a state for any individual yes. that is legally liable yes, for the enforcement of the laws. Yes. And then every person, yes, that had to pass a background check, yes, that I find that uh, did not qualify to volunteer in any capacity in any school right now. Right now. Right. Now, this is the law enforcement officers and firefighters retirement system. Yes. Could you, could you get me the retirements of every firefighter? I know I emailed the Port Angeles Fire Department and they are mandatory reporters. Yes. And I know that I emailed the police department and yesterday we went through the law, mm -hmm. uh, the LS law enforcement, um, no, uh, LS law, something, um, the, the certification through Homeland Security. Yes. Um, the LSEO, Law Enforcement um, Service Officers, yes. Why don't you get me their retirements? <laughs> Considering the federal government recognizes right now, <laughs> I would say... <laughs>